No, no, I did like his playlist. Are my whole team? Oh. They used to be like, we have fun on this set because where Shahid's music? Where is his music? Like he not come like before me or something on set. It was like we were missing his music more than <laughs> <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> What if somebody steals them or reads them? I don't write anything like that. So what do you write? No, I write a lot of work sometimes. I don't have that. Like I have a diary where I write like, you know. You did know? very well on your first day, Kriti. Like because really? we started the first day of, our, of me and Kriti. I, I shot two, walk. three days before, four days. Hmm. And that first day when me and Kriti did our scene together. I, I said that because I just feel like uh, it's something that one would end up doing more often if one is single. Hmm. And it should, if it's to the same degree when you're... Our are all the same. That's a good thing, right? Insane. You won't get so much fun. Sorry. Okay. Not a pet lover? Hello everyone, this oh, is fine. Aina and welcome to Instant Bollywood. I'm in conversation with Shahid Kapoor and Kriti Sanan. Welcome guys. Thank you, Aina. So refreshing to see the trailer where there's Romko, Masti, AI, a lot happening. So my first question to you is the last time I spoke to you all, you told me that it was so much fun and easy working with Kriti and you told me that... You know, man, tell her the truth, man. Tell the truth. You did tell me that. <laughs> did he say this? Yeah, he was like, it was so But it was fun. fun. And easy to work with her, and he you even said that he's one of the best dressed yeah, I did. male celebrities. I so I did give him a compl uh, compliment on your sure, interview yeah. show, and then I sent it to him, so he <laughs> knows that I did say this. I sent it to you on DMs. Yeah, you did. Yeah. <laughs> when did this no joke bond actually happen? Like y'all are like full of musty, and when did this actually you know unwrap on the schedule? In the first couple of days, we kind of realized like yeah. we're chill, and we don't need to be careful or you know, politically correct mm -hmm. or like I felt she was chill and normal. Yeah. I was in a good chill mood because I was doing a light, easy, fun film. I think she also came in like and then we like similar music. So we took yeah. the music on the set and the scenes were fun. Yeah, he started updating my Punjabi playlist. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Whoa. Which was a big deal for her because she was like, how can you have a song that I like but I don't know <laughs> about the song? <laughs> you didn't want to admit you like his playlist. No, no, I did like his playlist. Are my whole team. Oh. They used to be like, we have fun on this set because where's Shahid's music? Where is his music? Like he not come like before me or something on set. It was like, we were missing his music more than <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> you know, because this has AI in, today, in today's technology and like world, we are so like tech savvy. I personally still, you know, for my to-do list will take my diary, pen and paper. Oh, I also have my diary. Yeah, you journal, but I all the kind of people who still need your old school ways to deal with day-to-day -day things or just the larger things in life. I think I'm pretty old school. Uh, Although I don't have a diary to make notes, I do that on notes on my phone. But in other things, mm -hmm. I'm pretty old school. Like yeah. what? Do you allow your children to watch <coughs> anything? Allow my children? I mean, they. Yeah, it's tough to uh, not let them. You know, <laughs> you just have to control the degree to which they are, uh, you know, yeah. watching the screen. But even in schools right now, mm. kids are using screens. So that's the future. But you have to just kind of make sure that it doesn't go overboard. Yeah. What about you? I mean, I, I do journal sometimes, though I honestly have stopped since the yeah. last few months. Um, but I still sort of write, I have like two, three diaries where I like write certain things. If it's a short thing, then I do use my notes. Yeah. But sometimes like I like maintaining diary, diaries for different, different things. I have an issue with diaries. Like I feel like what if somebody steals them or reads them. I don't write anything like that. So what do you write? No, I write a lot of work sometimes. I don't write anything like I have a diary where I write like, like things that I want to do. Mm -hmm. Haan, even for characters, even when I'm working on characters, I like writing it in a diary. I never mm -hmm. ever write on my phone. But like certain notes or to do or you know sometimes I have this thing of packing because I forget mm. things and I'm yeah. always paranoid that I have to pack something so I have to make a list bana ke rakhte usme. Right. so those things are there but I still you feel yourself? sometimes uh, so otherwise you give the list to the person who's packing no otherwise I check <laughs> you check I check then rather just pack it's faster no no you, you make yourself? a list then you give it to a person then he packs then you check that do you pack? Imagine just packing for yourself. Yeh rakha, yeh rakha, yeh rakha, yeh rakha like that. I pack for myself. Yeah? I don't like packing. Packing is so tedious. I hate packing. I don't like packing. But I also still feel like... I'm particular about how I want to keep the clothes in the space management. I don't care. I also still feel like like handwritten notes are like just so much more meaningful than long messages. 
Yeah, absolutely. I Correct. think messages are just a bad idea because nobody understands the tone. So I actually feel that writing in general can uh-huh. be misinterpreted. So I just feel like I prefer like this. Talking conversation. Yeah, even if it's this, at least you can hear the tone of somebody's voice so yeah. you know the connotation. Yeah, absolutely I agree with that. Shahid for you, you know this film being a rom-com releasing in theaters and you know Bloody Daddy actually came, was an action film that released on OTT. <laughs> yeah. It's the other way around. It's so lovely to see that you're not following the rules that people are right now. Are you saying that love stories should now only be uh, seen digitally? It should be and that's why I said it's so lovely about I feel it's the kind of love story. You know, yeah. I think uh, what people want to see on the big screen needs to have that value. Like this is not a small town love story. Everything is very intimate, small family, small house, everything like that. I think those are the kind of films that now people would probably want to watch like that. But I think this film, this subject has a very I think like group viewing will be a thing for this film. Say, like yeah. families and yeah. friends can go together. Couples, it's Valentine's week. Ninth is very close. Yeah. Uh, so I think couples can watch the film together. I feel that there is an element of something that's larger than life because it is Sifra. And as you see the film, the fact that she is AI, yeah. as you see the film, you'll understand that. I also feel that it's been shot on nice big locations and we've mounted the film. Yeah. Um, the music was a very big part of why we wanted to take it to the theaters because I was missing seeing a song that I watch and I'm like, I want to see this in the theater, man. Yeah. So we wanted to go for music like that. The way we planned to shoot Lal Pili Akhya and Gulab and now this track, which is a music video. But the other two are very much in the film, you know, and I feel like they have that quality that, you know, come and watch me in the theater. We wanted to do songs like that, yeah. uh, which are big and which are like high energy and which have that kind of, which give you that experience that you want to get in a theater. I also danced after what, like a decade. In yes, must go to the theater. For that. <laughs> you did say you missed dancing last yeah. time. We I did. actually realized how much I missed so many things about yeah. this genre and because I've done it in the past and you know I've had fun doing it and I think I've evolved as an actor in the last eight nine years and what was a question I think I was happy with I felt like I don't know what I'll have to offer new. Yeah. Will I be repeating myself in movies that I've already done when I see this film will I look like same expression same thing. But while doing the film, I realized that no, as an actor, you grow and evolve. Yes. And I think there is something new that I can give the audience in a genre like this. I felt that while I was making the film, honestly. Mm. And, you know, so I would be happy to do this genre once in a while if it offers me something new, which this film did because it's a high concept film. And I think everybody will be curious. Ki, yaar, ye, ye kaise ho sakta hai? Yeah. You know, I love that. I love the fact that people are saying, ye kaise ho sakta hai, yaar? Yeah. And that is why you come and see the film. And let's see if we've answered your question. More than you, you know. we love the fact that you're doing a love story. So <laughs> I have you. to say that. I was about to say, you must do it for the audiences. Yeah. But I also enjoy doing it. Yeah. I can, I, I enjoy doing it. It's not like it's a struggle and I'm only doing it. No, I can't work like that as and an you actor. I can't work like that. I can't. I, there's so many times people tell you, you audience go, I'm like, but I don't have a feeling in my mind, so how So yeah. Shruti, for you, even when I was watching, like I told you, first half of the trailer, you can't tell like she's a robot. But then later, you know, it's difficult to kind of not <laughs> give out expressions and still not give out to the audience that you're a robot. How did you kind of balance playing that? Because I think that's harder than usual. Yeah, it is hard because it's tricky and it's a thin, thin yeah. line. You have to maintain it while you're subtle because this robot can't suddenly be like extremes. <laughs> um, and I also feel like uh, to make it believable that a guy like him, who's pretty intelligent, yeah. uh, can fall for her and actually fall in love with her and you would want to see them together. Yeah. You would need her to be very close to being a human being. You would want to believe in that feeling, you know. Yeah. But still, you know that she's a robot, so she can't completely be a human being. So it was a tricky thing to kind yeah. of balance. And uh, honestly, I think I kind of kept getting a hang of it as we kept shooting because mm-hmm. I was like, is this too robotic? Is this too human? Is this yeah. so... You, you did know? very well on your first day, Kriti. Like because really? we started the first day of our of me and Kriti. I, I shot two, walk. three days before, four days. Hmm. And that first day when me and Kriti did our scene together, where the characters meet each other, was the first day of shoot. And actually, usually, which is what was told to me also on this film, and it's told to me very often, is that people don't like to do introductions of the first I scene usually, first yeah. Yeah. because it's better to do it later when you're more in flow because the first couple of days you're still figuring it out. Yeah. And I am the opposite. I'm oh, like, do that. let's do the, that first because mm-hmm. if we get that right, then everything's going to be right. Also, I like shooting as linear as possible, mm-hmm. especially because when there is a relationship between AI and a human being, yeah. how do you know what the seventh scene would be between them when as opposed to the first, first scene? Yeah. Because the AI is processing me constantly and I am 
around actually in a love story it's nicer to do the first scene first because because especially when those two people are meeting for the first time you know because that that scene is very so that that was actually one of the reasons where I was also like no let's see how Aryan which is my character and Sifra like how does it begin yeah let's let's discover that and that will actually set context to how it develops and grows and culminates right Mm. so she was on on the first day like I feel like she was in it maybe she wasn't feeling it Mm. but I was also looking at her very critically yeah because I knew that if she doesn't work this film doesn't work (laughs) it's true yeah you know because that is what is new in this film right that is the twist of the film that is what the willing suspension of disbelief which is the definition of cinema that is the leap you need to take and say huh मेरे को जम रहा है ठीक है क्या होएगा right yeah. so she was fundamental for that and i just felt like it started off on the right note it did one. but i think i didn't have because i didn't have a reference back, point felt, yes yeah. because i didn't have a reference point so i was like i was always like theek ho raha na theek ho raha ye zyada to nahi hai kam to nahi hai like that so because i also didn't know ki ye kaisa dikhega ye kitna and there were times later in certain scenes when obviously we were a lot more comfortable like he would perform and he's a great actor when he's doing something in front of you hmm. you know whether it's emotion whether it's something i had to keep a check on me cuz i would react humanly hmm. you know where i'm like i felt like saying something instantly but i'm like okay no but this is sifra so i think that little just second guessing everything that you're doing was a lot more there in this film than any other because sometimes you know you can just like impulsively do something sifra can't impulsively do something plus so, no reference point yeah, is a huge yeah 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 but sifra is still processing but really fast yeah but processing you know and yeah. that stuff like you have to look like there's a difference between thinking and processing hmm. yeah. i think she got that and you have to feel like kuch hai pata nahi kya hai hmm. you know like hmm. i don't know like yeah she's pretty human but i i don't know like that that's how you wanted to play it yeah i mean that's how i yeah. wanted it to Come be across. perceived yeah You know, there's this line in the trailer that says, "Mujhe pata hai ki wo robot hai, but I still have feelings for her." Yeah. Has this happened to you in real life, where you feel like, "Okay, I know the lesser or bad qualities about this person, but I'm still in love with him." That's actually the reason <laughs> why I thought people will get this film. Oh, yeah. Because we all have been in, in situations, situations, and it only happens when you have feelings yeah. for somebody. Whether you want to call it love, infatuation, whatever you want to call it, right? But when feelings get involved. logic stops functioning true, and right, i think true. we all have been in situations like that in life where yaar mere ko pata hai but <laughs> nahi ho raha you know nahi ho raha feeling ho rahi hai andar se nahi hat nahi raha man you know yeah. that i think is the fundamental reason why i buy, bought into this film because wo emotion hum sab experience kar chuke yeah you know the other reason is because i love my bike as much as i love a human being so i could understand <laughs> that you can have love for something that might not be human yeah. or even uh, alive technically but i love it so much you know so yeah. i have that feeling for my motorcycle for example so yeah. those are the two things that i could draw parallels to and say ha i think this script works what about you prithvi i mean i think everybody has been in that situation honestly True. when if you do fall in love you kind of as he said Yeah. right wrong all of that gets like really mixed up and sometimes you know that this is not good for you or you know this is not like how it should be or you know in the long run it won't work and stuff like that there are lots of questions lots of people sometimes tell you things mm. you know but what you're feeling is just so on as that you're just feeling it you can't help it so yeah True. okay before i go there's a small segment that i'm going to play so i'm going to give you like couple situations and you have to tell me if you're going to treat you're married but you're going to just believe it that you're not this disclaimer you're married but you're going to treat this like you're not yeah like you know, just for this segment okay so okay honey i act for a living <laughs> <laughs> the first situation is if your partner is a vegetarian or a non vegetarian and they want you to turn what they are would you is that a block or a like no no Yeah, yeah. If they feel like doing it themselves, then that's their personal journey. But it's not your business. Yeah. It's not my business what you eat. Not very tech savvy. What about it? Like, if your partner's not very tech savvy, that's okay. Are you okay? It's okay. Great. Because I am not so tech savvy, <laughs> so it's okay. Yeah, forgive me. <laughs> okay. If uh, your partner posts a lot of thirst trap pictures, good what question. About <laughs> <laughs> I very think I will block <laughs> it. बेटा तुझे जरूरत है बाहर से कुछ जो तुझे घर पे नहीं मिल रहा है. डिपेंड्स व्हाट डू यू फील आपको क्या लगता है कि आप चाहेंगे कि आपका पार्टनर सबको दिखाए जो वो सिर्फ आपको दिखा डिपेंड्स कितना दिखा रहा है अब शी हैज अ नहीं ये सवाल को थोड़ा विस्तार से 
जवाब दीजिए कि कितने ठीक है कितने लड़के घूमते हैं आई इट्स लाइक अ वेरी नॉर्मल या बट लाइक इफ दे कीप पोस्टिंग यू नो इट कैन बी अ बिट ऑफ अ टर्न ऑफ फॉर सम पीपल नहीं बट तुझे अच्छा लगता है तो रख ले मतलब इट्स समय में अच्छा लगा आई डोंट थिंक आई केयर बट आई डोंट थिंक आई लव बट आई डोंट थिंक आई विल ब्लॉक फॉर दैट रीजन सो दैट्स इट ओके रोस्ट यू अ लॉट आई आई सेड दैट बिकॉज़ आई जस्ट फील लाइक it's something that one would end up doing more often if one is single hmm. and it should if it's to the same degree See, when you because you're, she's she's saying partner right uh-huh. which means you're in a committed relationship uh-huh. unless you're an actor then i mean that's, like it's a part of the job yeah, yeah, so like, then i have to yeah, accept yeah. tricky yeah. okay if roast you a lot in public if your partner roast you a lot in public yeah block no mean i'll give a this lecture yeah. on it but yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think it depends on the nature of the roasting. Like, mm-hmm. if you feel like the intent is just funny and they don't really mean. Sometimes it's subtext, right? Yeah. Like they say, like. See, can't be disrespectful. Most, that's it. Yeah, the, some yeah. of the most serious things are said as a joke. Yeah. You know, so if I get that vibe, then it's no. But if it's just fun and banter, then it's then chill. Then it's bro. fine. Okay, if your partner's a workaholic and has no time and like has to remove time, Mushkil. it's a no for me. It's a no. Yeah. Uh, a workaholic has no time. Yeah, of course. I, I need am time. demanding. So, workaholic people can also take a time. It depends on what you want to prioritize. If you are so busy for me, then I find other people to get busy with. <laughs> <laughs> are you okay with this? I love the disclaimer that is coming. Married, but it's okay. You can be. No, no. I'm supposed to be single right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. yeah I didn't get to do this for eight yeah. years. I'm excited. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, loves you a lot, but isn't very expressive about it. Mm. Uh, isn't very expressive about yeah, it. Yeah, like some people are not very. If they love me, I'm okay. Yeah. If they're yeah because if they actually love me but are not expressive. Yeah. As opposed to somebody who doesn't love me so much but is showing me a lot, I hate those types. Yeah, that's true. Unko block karo, bhai. That's true. That's true. Ah. That's true. If okay. if I feel I, genuinely hai, to theek hai. It's their personality not to express. Yeah. Yeah. But you need it. Uh, thoda sa. Little na. I need. Thoda to chahiye. I need like little like. Uski aankhon mein dekh lena. Andar pyar hoga kya? Matlab aisa bahut andar bhi nahi hona chahiye. Thoda tease bahar hona chahiye. Bahut andar. Okay, like अच्छा अच्छा कितना अंदर अंदर इज़ बहुत अभी तेरा सब डिस्कशन उसमें होता है। है 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 वो 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 � बोल दिया है कंफेस कर दिया आई डोंट नो कि बेटा ये मेरी आदत है आदत नहीं है कि मैंने ये किया हो गया है नहीं अगर बार-बार किया है तो आदत है ना एनीथिंग यू डू ओवर एंड ओवर इज अ हैबिट नो वंस इफ दे चीट ओनली वंस एक बार हुआ सी इफ द पर्सन इज टेलिंग मी दैट आई डोंट थिंक आई वुड जज समवन फॉर देयर पास्ट बिकॉज़ आई डू बिलीव दैट पीपल कैन बी डिफरेंट इन डिफरेंट इक्वेशन सो Hmm. I mean, I, I don't think I'll block for that reason I am keeping it somewhere in the middle because I will have my eye ke bhai Yeah, you you can have 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 eye, eye. but but not blocking na, but then then the 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 what's the fun of the relationship? Like I I want to be trusting in the relationship. Like cringy reality shows. I, I don't judge people's I mean, taste. I don't judge Can't people's block taste uh, in content because everybody has their Different. taste and True. you know what's cringy to you might for you what might be cringy to them. So right, prefers texts over calls. Text yeah, over calls. Like Some people prefer. Yeah. Prefers texting. texting over calls. Prefers no, or like, prefers? No, but like regarding what? Doesn't like, want to call. Keeps texting. No, doesn't want to call. I'm sorry, can't be. Ah, yeah. nee, yeah. you Calling. need to have some real contact. I mean, yeah. anyways, calls are also. Not complete. At least like some yeah. form, na yeah. some voice, face, yeah. something. Something. मतलब हमारा सब same चल रहे हैं यार. अच्छी बात है ना. Insane. नहीं मिलेगा तुझे इतना अच्छा लॉन्डा का. Sorry. Okay. Not a pet lover. Not a pet lover. That's okay. I mean, I don't judge. Don't yeah, that's okay. Uh, people can There turn into uh, pet lovers, by the way. Yeah, I was not a pet lover. You so. turned. Someone know. turned you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so turned you. Yeah. Turned you. There. Lastly, um, is an introvert, but ma- expects you to make an initiative for every plan. ये ना मुझे ऐसा लग रहा है तेरी जितनी भी खुद की भड़ास है पक चुकी है ना सारी तूने एक दिन चीजें अपने जर्नल निकाल के लिख दी ये क्या था इसने या बट यू नो दे एक्सपेक्ट यू टू मेक एन इनिशिएटिव बिकॉज़ समटाइम्स व्हेन यू एक्सपेक्ट द अदर पर्संस ओनली मेकिंग प्लान्स इट कैन गेट टू यू सी यू इवेंचुअली डू वांट बोथ वे इनिशिएटिव्स एंड आई एम अ बिट ऑफ एन एंबिवर्ट सो इफ ही इज एन इंट्रोवर्ट आई डोंट थिंक हम कभी कुछ होगा एंबिवर्ट Like who are like introvert in the beginning, but then eventually when they open up, they can be extroverts. Like. मतलब तू अपनी सच्चाई छुपा के रखती है. 
No, I take time to open up with people in general. I take time to open up with people in general. Even I'm an ambivert, so I relate. Max. I will say I cannot have somebody their whole life expecting me to plan everything. Yeah, that's true. I don't think that's acceptable. You know, beginning may come here, but after that, that's okay. But if my whole life I'm going to be doing all the work, I'm like, no. No, no. I suck at planning, so no. Awesome. Thank you so much. We're back to reality. Shahid's married now. Back to reality. You're married now. Thank you so much. All the very best. for the film love the trailer and i'm sure it's going to do super super well thank just thank you